Okay, it's another game modifier. I don't think I've played a game where it hasn't been a modifier in about like two weeks or something. Like, extra kit, short grace. Oh my god. It can't stop being short grace. And we've got the farmer kit. Oh, lunchbox, actually, which is really good because I can make cornucopia straight away. And if you don't know what cornucopia is, basically I can make a light apple and then I can do this. And that's cornucopia, so regen two for 10 seconds. All right, this entic guy is 100% cheating. He's got four kills without, like, taking any damage. <laughs> he just, you can just tell this guy loves it. Look what this guy said as well. You're one of the worst people. You bow, run, and rod, and then complain about the game. I have every single right to complain about the game, and so does everybody else. Someone behind me. Okay, and you'll be hopping. I think so, anyway. Yep, definitely be hopping. Wait, are they stupid? Like, GG. That's so strange, like, what is- How can you find that fun in a dead game? It just doesn't make any sense. You know what? The Brewmaster's modifier is actually really good. Okay, so now these are awkward potions. We do this. All right, there we go. Three poison pots. HP 17, there he is. Now he's just going to be friendly. But now I've poisoned him, he'll probably get triggered. What a little weirdo. Like, he's actually mad. He's on six. Yeah, he's not going to play. Alright guys, so we're in the next game and it's true UHC. The fact that that guy was complaining about the game being dead and everything, that he just goes and plays legit thinking he's being all nice and stuff, and then he just b-hops as soon as I poison him because he's mad about it. Like, it pretty much just sums up, like, the average UHC player, like. And then after he killed me, he said, sorry, it's because you poisoned me. Like, what? <laughs> just b-hop on me anyway? Like, does it really matter if I poisoned you or not? We got a sharpness to iron, we got two lava buckets, that's all you need. I could go up with a wooden sword, as long as I've got lava buckets, we should be able to do pretty well. I just have to make sure I land the lava buckets. Okay, that's three hearts gone. I'm pretty sure this is the map I just played, where I got hit through walls. It must be. Whoa, there's someone here, but they're invisible. That's so weird. I wonder if they saw me. Uh, I'm gonna fight this person. They don't have any water, so they're dead if I get them in lava. Okay, they got water. But they placed it straight away. They got more water and placed it straight away. That wasn't the smartest thing to do. Oh, you're trapping, aren't you? you must be. Yep. Right, that should kill them, actually. I think. Almost. There we go. Can someone explain what this event level thing is as well, by the way? Like, I have no idea what that means. All right, there's another person here. Let's go. Lava, 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 lava. I should probably make a G-head. There we go. This guy's been, like, in every single game I've played today. Um, so that means he's been, like, dying very early. And so have I. But I've died to, like, be opposite. I don't know who this guy's died to. Oh, there's someone there with a chest plate. I can kill that. that I've killed... This is the guy that I killed last time when I played Drury HC. What are the odds? Literally, I got one kill and then I got the op done, and it was killing this guy. So he knows what's going to happen, probably. He's got a diamond sword though, so I don't know if it's worth taking the damage for that kill. One person dies and then it's straight to deathmatch. I can't really leave these two here, because they'll probably fight each other. And then whoever wins that fight will just win the game. Okay, that's a lot of damage taken. I'm on 11 HP. Yes, that's perfect. It would be nice if my lava could actually, like, place in the position I put it in, though. Because I probably would have done loads of damage by now. Like that, for example. Like, this guy's dead. There we go. Let's get the gold. Sharpness 3. Diamond boots. Make sure no one's around me. Make a G head. Alright, give me a head, please. Okay, that's rubbish. That's actually so bad. Okay, so who's this? He's got diamond boots. I want to know what happened to the guy with the chest plate because he hasn't got a single kill since running away. 
which is kind of strange. Like, he might have dug down, but I don't know. I've got sharp three in a G head, so even without lava, I'm pretty sure I can kill this guy. Okay, another trap. And I don't have the iron axe anymore. He's on 43 HP. I don't think it's worth going for, to be honest. <gasps> Wait, there's someone there with a pumpkin on their heads. What are the odds? Imagine this is the guy that's actually trapping, and then the one behind me, I like, accidentally ran into the trap, and he jumped, like, perfectly. Who is it, though? Keza. It's just quite a good name. So you'd expect him to know what he was doing. At least a little bit. Right, do I make another G-Heads? I think I do, to be honest. And we got a bow now as well, which is quite nice. I don't know if this guy's going to be at his trap. Okay, I was going to say I'll catch him before he gets back to his trap. So that's what we're going to try to do. Oh, there's someone chasing him. Who's the person chasing him, though? I swear I saw someone chasing him. Okay, he's literally relying on getting back into his trap, so that's very annoying. He's on 11. Shouldn't have let- <laughs> imagine I just walked back into that. That would have been so bad. Whoa, you're digging pretty aggressively. That's kind of strange. This person's probably cheating. Need to make a flint and steel or something. Come on, keep spleefing him, what are you doing? Aye, Henry's on 22, 12. There we go. We got the head, so we just keep building up. I don't think he had any lava, which is kind of annoying, but it's whatever. Salty Loy with another kill on 20 HP. Okay, is that salty? It is. So they don't, they're not on Lunar, I mean. So, um, I don't know could be cheating. Like, if someone's playing legit, I don't understand why you'd want to use anything else other than Luna. Alright, let's see how this goes. I think we have to go to middle. Okay, we kill this guy instead. You're on 40 HP. Come on, what are you running away from? Okay, that's not good, because someone's going to get middle very easily. I swear that's so annoying. He dropped his sword. So many people have been doing that recently. Salty Loy got that kill. Okay, they're going to be the most stacked out of everyone, I think. Whoa, what was that? Hello? Oh my god, I just realized how much fall damage I took. Jeez. Is he really just w running through all of that? What is he doing? I'm confused. Alright, well, it's been a pretty good game. I've got five kills. Like, you know what? I'll take it. Okay, I've been on the same health for ages. I wish this guy would just end the game. Like, he can literally end it so easily. Oh, he had a G head, so that's perfect. But he's gonna die. Like, this other guy is just doing nothing. I said I had no healing. This one can literally just end the game right now if he wanted to. Don't know what's going on. No, you got one chance. Yeah, this guy's way too stacked. He wasn't at 0-0 for like the whole game. He killed a few people towards the end. Like he had 7 kills, fair enough. Yeah, that wasn't a bad game. Yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure to like and subscribe. And see you later.